Marquise Horn. It is for it's more personal than a Horn bonus situation. These two bigs in Norman have the entire front line of Preston and Falco. Both the bigs have four right now. JD and Sellinger have all of the free throw attempts combined in this basketball game right now. They're playing power basketball. They really are. Look at the punch in and through the JD Weatherspoon or Sellinger to be effective down low. And the two men are delivering. Three for five from the free throw strike, as is Sullinger. They've got ten attempts, so two big men have split them. Second one coming, and he knocks down both of them. But J.D. Weatherspoon's come in and had a nice third quarter to give his team a nice nine-point cushion. J.D. Weatherspoon has come in on a big lift for his team. With all that being said, this is still only down nine in the quarter. Gets it into Orlando Williams. Williams avoids the block of Sullinger. some kind of rhythm and get his players back into it, they're going to lose this game. Well, you're not going to get that rhythm just in front of the crowd out here as they have, because they're, they're going to voice their opinion no matter what. You've got to get control of your ball club. Say, listen, get back to the way we play. Kristen got to the state final for playing a specific way. Right now, they're playing Helter Skelter. I can't actually tell what they're trying to accomplish. One more free throw coming. J.D. Witherspoon. Nine points, five rebounds. points in this third quarter. All nine of J.D.'s points have come here in the third quarter, and it's a ten-point lead for the Northland Vikings. Mike, the worst thing you can do as a player is lose your composure at any point in the ball game. I mean, a barrage of points can be scored in a minute. So nine points can easily be down to four and, and, a, and a few trips up and down the court. You don't want to give a team an opportunity to widen the lead by going to the line making free throws uncontested. Ricky Bennett in the basketball game for Northland. Trey Burke running down the clock. Pulls up. Too strong. Bennett battles for the rebound, but he's going to get called for the foul as Seibert collected the basketball, and you hear the Princeton fans cheer. Jordan Seibert going up high to grab that one. Now they've got almost six ticks on the clock left. Let's see if they can convert something. Go in the quarter, the end of the quarter on a positive note. Three seconds left. Davis rises for three and rattled in and out. And that's the way the third quarter comes to an end. So J.D. Weatherspoon comes off the bench after early foul trouble. Picks up nine points here in this third quarter. And Northland, the number one team in the state, led by Mr. Basketball, they're on top by ten. STO, your home for the Indians, brings you Cactus League Baseball from Goodyear Ballpark. It's an interleague matchup in Arizona when the Tribe take on San Diego. Padres versus Indians, live Monday at 7, only on STO. Sunday nights on STO HD. At 7, all bets are off when Bruce Drennan tells it like it is, live. At 9, make a tee time for the Golf Zone with Jimmy Hanlon. Sunday night, starting at 7, on STO HD. 
when, when it comes to Ohio high school sports, there's only one website that offers the full experience. OhioHSSports.com. Scores, stats, live webcast, audio and video archives, photo uploads, from goal line stands to game winning spikes. Go where the action is. The exclusive online home for OHSAA state championships. OhioHSSports.com. It's where high school sports play. Pre-sale is underway for the Drennan Division Rivals six-pack. Simply go to Indians.com forward slash 